Hi, this is Noah Van Hoffman for TheOutdoorsGuy.com. This weekend, I was on a South Florida fishing pier watching some people struggling to use a bridge net. The reason they were having trouble is because they did not take into consideration the current or the length of the rod and kept trying to bring the fish back into the net when the current was pushing the net further under the pier. Eventually they figured it out and put the net in front of the fish and let it drift back under. This was also compounded by the length of the rod they were using. With bigger fish or a strong current, you may want to have the rod lead the fish from the side into the net. This will nullify the effects of the current and allow you to get the fish into the net much easier. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel or visit us at theoutdoorsguy.com. Remember, we're out there.